What's going on everybody? Rest in Peaches here with a brand new video and today I'm showing you guys uh, you know how to fish and how to catch the last fish the monster fish the big fish the final mission for the fishing guy I can't remember his name off the top of my head, but so It takes place on the on the beach resort That's where the mission actually is once you beat all the other ones and the fish which I found out after like a couple minutes of like I know the fish is supposed to be here, but should it be a map marker on the fish map? Is it one of the golden fish? And then I realized that it doesn't actually show up on the mini map. The uh, this fish, the last fish for the quest line, it's just swimming around. So you actually have to s throw out a couple lines and uh, and kind of hope that you see it. Once you see it, it's a big fish. It is extremely large. You can see it on the screen right now. So it's really hard to miss once you throw it around a little bit. I actually found it off to the right, all the way back to the right as far as I could throw it to the uh, to the right between the, uh, the two bobs out there you can see. But as you can see, you know, I'm only a level uh, six, I think, in fishing. And I have a rod and reel with just over 200 uh, attack and defense, and I'm using the Dragon's Beard line. I believe that's what it what it's called. I'll show all the gear that I'm using, but it's all about how you fish, more or less than your gear going in, because the gear does help. But if you understand how to fish, then uh, it'll make fishing easier for as long as you play. So the number one thing is always have controller vibration on when you're fishing because. On the Xbox One, which is what I'm playing on, it vibrates if you're not reeling at all. So if it's vibrating while you're not reeling, don't start to reel because that'll tense the line. So you actually have to just hold the left stick in the direction that the fish is swimming, which is an on-screen command. And then if, if the controller is not vibrating, that's when you reel. Because that means there's zero tension online and now's your chance to reel it in. So this took me about, I want to say like, probably 10 minutes to reel this fish in. Because this is the second half of me reeling it in, and I think this clip is like 4 minutes long. And it took me a while to get a handle on it. And you can see that uh, I'm here at the last quarter, and I still have half my line left. So I was like, okay, like I'm doing good. You can see that whenever I reel in, it's only reeling, in, reeling it in a very small amount. But for a fish like this... Uh, without the best gear because I'm pretty sure I don't have the best gear for fishing You just have to know how to do it So if there's no slack on the line where your controller is not vibrating you start the reel As soon as it starts vibrating you let go because the fish is going to change directions and immediately tense your line and wear your durability and once your durability hits zero it resets the line and The fish gets away and we don't want to do that. You don't want this fish to get away um you can see here that it's like very, taking away small amounts of my durability because as soon as I feel the controller vibrate, I'm letting go of the right trigger to reel it in. Completely just, you know what? So this fish is going to take a while to catch, but it's definitely worth it. The payoff was awesome. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not that bad of a fish to catch if you just have a couple minutes to sit down and kind of reel it in, but... I'll be showing off all of my gear in just a couple seconds, so give it like, if you guys want to skip ahead like 30 seconds, I guess, that's when I'll be talking about my gear. Hey, looks like I landed a dream. Ah, oh, not bad. That's what a legend looks like. How should we cook it? Give me a hand. Just leave it to me. All right, so here we are. This is the fishing location. And I'm going to show off my gear. So there you go, the dragon's beard. Um, there's this rod and reel. Well, that's actually the... That's the rod you get for catching this fish. 
and this is the reel that I'm using for it. So I will show locations on where to get all of these things. Um, so the rod reel and um, dragon's beard, you actually get all three of those at the same location. And then the uh, the bob that I'm using, the bobber, um, you actually get it from your car. So fishing level seven, you can see there. You get this from your car. So when you're sitting in your car, uh, you press select. And it gives you the option to shop from your car. You can actually just buy it right there. Um, on my car, it gives me the option to buy the Dragon's Beard as well. The line that I use, but I will show the map location. So we're going to go all the way up here. And that's it. That's where you can get the rod, the reel, and the line that I'm using to catch this. So that's where you get everything. It's all on the map. It's all super easy. You just do one fishing mission at a time. Um, as always, thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing. I appreciate every single one of you. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys want to see next time. I know I've been getting a lot of hype in the Dark Souls video, but it's kind of hard to get footage for that right now. But as always, stay safe and rest in peaches.